These Libyan soldiers are being put through their paces at a boot camp in Italy. The first group of 340 soldiers arrived this month in Cassino between Rome and Naples as part of an international program to restore order in Libya, where instability has reigned since the ouster of dictator Muammar Gaddafi in 2011. We are learning to train together, to be one entity. It's very important for us to learn how to stay united. Each course lasts 14 weeks, and the aim is to prepare a total of 2,000 soldiers for combat over the coming months. This is very important because it will support a free Libya, and the creation of a strong army will become a reference point for democracy and security. The program includes Britain, Turkey and the United States for training, and is the result of a deal between the G8 global powers. Our mission is the same as it is for all armies in the world, to guard our borders and to ensure protection and security for our population, as well as collaborating with other countries. To help the new recruits, dozens of Italian soldiers are on hand and Captain Francesca Giardulli has even gone on a six-month intensive Arabic course. Language is one of the main barriers, but not the only one. These young civilians with no experience in the military, and so we really have to train them as if they were newbies. Many of these soldiers joined in the rebellion that ousted Gaddafi, and their presence has brought a taste of North Africa to this Italian army base. Menus have gone halal, timetables have changed to respect Islamic tradition, and the facility even has a new prayer room.